welcome to the VRBO Citrus Bowl as part of Capital One State from the Big Ten. Big vocal crowds on both sides. Time for a season like this on third and ten. McSorley with the pocket starting to collapse. Now will take off. McSorley's not going to get there. He's tackled short, got about eight. But, he, but a huge three and out by Kentucky. And a fake punt try. Kentucky was right there. Kentucky sniffed it out. Penn State snapped it short, and there was nowhere to go. What a big moment early for Mark Stoops' team. Wow. Wow. Quarterback Terry Wilson leading the way. Benny Snell, record-setting running back. Out in the open on the first play from scrimmage for the Wildcats. The three. They get the ball snapped. Wilson immediately pressured. He throws. It is complete, but out of bounds. Short of the first down. Taven Rich, eight yards. Their field goal kicking game this year has not been totally reliable. Good snap and hole. That kick is right down the middle. And a wildcat. Good position. Is he going to rush? McSorley down the sideline and incomplete. Trying to hit Jawan Johnson just a little too far. And that's what gets the ball on third and two. Wilson will give it to Snell. Snell picking his way forward. Got stuffed. He got stopped by records in every facet of it. McSorley hands the ball off. No, he faked it and delivered the ball perfectly. That's DeAndre Tompkins. First first down. Torrey could be four down territory depending on what they get here on third down. McSorley, that one right on the money. And it's going to be close. Very close to Tompkins again. Where do they spot him? I think just a little bit addition. He will hand the ball off to Sanders. Made a nifty move, and he got the first down. That was close. McSorley pressured right away. Got away from Allen the first time, but not the second. Man, did he get in the backfield in a flash. Josh Allen. Out. We'll try to tie the game. Got a low snap. The hold was down, but that kick was wide. Third and ten. Wilson in the pocket. Tries to take off. Still on his feet. And that one, Penn State swarming. Tackled well short of the first down. And that's the difference between the first side of Kentucky's defense. Josh Allen just came back in this game. He'll try to rush the passer. He gets double teamed. McSorley, though, goes down. So they paid so much attention to Josh Allen that Cash Daniel, oh, the middle linebacker, came through. <laughs> the motor. And now from the end zone, the punt with Lynn Bowden near the midfield line backs up a little bit. He's got some room to return this one. And very dangerous in the open field. What a move. Bowden trying to get to that corner. He does. To the 10. Touchdown. far Penn State extra point is up and good third down money down it was maybe a foot short they spotted him it is second down that's a first down and much more Trace McSorley to midfield so maybe number nine is just going to use his leg I got to mooch <laughs> in all those January one bowls of Bob and now we turn the favor out in the open with the speed the completion of the run after the catch for KJ Hamler had a great freshman year Stopped just short of the goal line. It's going to be first and goal, Penn State. I like this. I like it. We'll see if that matters. McSorley and Penn State going to try to punch it in. And McSorley throwing it over the top. Touchdown. Nick Bowers. It's a flat out winner. Extra point for Pinnegar is up, and that one is good. Wilson waited and shows that speed and athleticism straight up the gut to the 21. Yeah, I think this is what he does. Bowden came in motion. Wilson steps up, goes down. Sharif Miller got there for the sack. They did. I think you were right about it why they decided not to go for it but sorely nice run stumbles ahead down to the 35 first down so second and ten McSorley hands the ball off Slade with his speed 
Ricky Slade first down at the Lions inside the 25. Has accomplished as McSorley. Low snap. He's pressured immediately, and McSorley just had nowhere to go. Man, that pressure came so fast. Derek Beatty off the outside. Good snap and hold, and that kick was tipped. Wobbly, no good. Wow. The special teams play has been so big in this first half. <laughs> Did he get his hand up? to handle him, but, you know, that's the advantage of Kentucky with all the movement they've done with him. I expect we're going to see more of Benny Snell. Breaking tackle. Snell hurtling defenders. Goes out of bounds. What a run from Benny Snell, one of the all-time greats in the history of this program. What do they say? Could be a good one at the next level, too. He's not the biggest guy. He's not the fastest guy. He just gets it done. Wilson on the move got away and manages to find his man in a big hit. And that might be targeting about this game. Wilson, designed quarterback run, shoots through. Wilson, close to the goal line, stopped at about the two, maybe a yard and a half short, than a yard near the goal line. Wilson hands it off. Snell to the left side. Benny Snell, touchdown. Offensively on the board for the Wildcats today. High snap, good hold, extra point, up and good. It's been an adventure for both 41 is lurking. Clifford trying to get away, cannot. Another sack for the Wildcats defense. This time, T.J. Carter. So now Snell will empty the backfield. Wilson faked like he was going to throw. That, I think, was a design run all the way. Wilson across the 40, out to the Play fake, a little quick hitter, and the turn up field. Bowden, first down, Kentucky again. Those are the play. It's easy for D7. The last year that Kentucky won 10 football games in a year. Bowden gets another catch out of the right flat, uses a stiff arm to get away. Lynn Bowden's been tremendous in this game. Penalty flags flying all. Wilson back in, fakes it to Snell, pitches it, and Penn State has this well defended. Losing four, maybe five yards. Tate. Kick is up and good. So two for two from that exact distance. Miles Butler, the senior. This game in space to create matchups. Got to get back to it. There's a quick hitter for a first down Penn State. Number 84, Jawan Johnson. With McSorley, such a big part of their offense. Will that be limited now? Pressure picked up. McSorley looking downfield. Heaves it downfield. And what an interception. What an interception by Lonnie Johnson. And he's bringing it back along the far sideline. There's a penalty flag throw. McSorley got blocked. Maybe that's the penalty by Cash Daniel. I think Trace thought he had a touchdown in the history of Kentucky football. He wants it. He's leading the cheers for the Kentucky fans. They will fake it to Snell and throw. That's Bowden missed tackle. Out of the open with blockers ahead. There goes Lynn Bowden down the sideline. Inside the 20. All the way down inside the 10. The fans want him to get it. Here he goes. Benny Snell straight ahead. He's got the record and the touchdown. of Kentucky football. There's your all-time leading rusher. That's pretty great to see what that means to him. Oh, look at it. Look at the hug. Mark Stoops on the sideline. Teammates will go higher than he will. Oh, he, he's going to play in the NFL. And with his speed, gets a Penn State first down. But the personality of this team, the heart and soul. How many draft picks? Yeah, Mark Stoops has done that kind of developmental job. Catch and run. That's Justin Shorter, true freshman, huge recruit. He was Benny Snell, Penn State. Can they make a last push? If number nine has anything to say about it, they will. He takes a big lick and run. Second down and four. McSorley having a backpedal. Now he's got his man open inside.
inside the 10, down to the 5, DeAndre Tompkins, first and goal. Penn State. Well, that was a really nice route. And Slade in motion. The fake. McSorley, touchdown. He just not going to and the handshakes with the teammates, too. Not like Trace McSorley. Is back, hoping for a chance to return a punt. From Max Duffy. Shorter punt. This one, I don't think, is returnable. But now Allen licking his chops. McSorley steps up, and he throws. Nice delivery. First down, Penn State. That is a huge play. Jahan Dotson going to come back to him and make a huge third down conversion. 24 yards. McSorley, a little touch throw, and what a catch by the tight end. Fire move. The right way, and you're seeing it. Not just playing, but gutting it out. McSorley, all kinds of time, and he finds his young tight end again. Fighting for the pylon. Touchdown. Man to make every single play. They need to get back to their group ball. And Penn State's done what they've done in McSorley's career. That is fight to the very Wilson pressured immediately. Heaves one incomplete. Slade did not get the ball. Guess who got the ball? Out to midfield. First down, Nittany Lions. So that's a loss of six. Second and 16. McSorley over the middle. First down and more. This is the second tight end. Nick Bowers, those tight ends have been huge for Penn State. They hand the ball off to Miles Sanders. What a call and what a run. First down, Penn State. Got some backup corners in the game. McSorley. That ball knocked down, incomplete. I think that's Boogie Watson who got a hand up and swap formation for Kentucky. Play clock winding down. They get it snapped. Good hold. Kick is up, and it is good. So the first make of the day for the... He does. He jumped over a defender, and Snell surges forward. He got the first down, or at least real close. Continued to give him an opportunity. Snell... One last carry in his Kentucky career gets to midfield, goes down, not easily. So that's right about what we were saying a long time ago. Here we go. McSorley throws short. They'll pitch it back, and the ball's on the turf. Kentucky falls out of the Wildcats. Maybe their best year ever. And a hard-earned ice bath and hug for their head coach. And their star players who came to play today in Orlando. What a win for Kentucky over the 12th ranked Nittany Lions 27.